see what is the next thing that blender can offer us before starting what you need to do is go to the edit menu and in the edit menu you can find preferences and in the preferences tab go to add-ons and then you search for extra and you get this add mesh extra objects because of that what will happen is we get from add menu if you go to mesh you get this extra objects and today's extra object is torus super toyed and torus not so before starting let me delete this cube i'm sorry for the cube may god bless him so mesh and torus and super toyed so what this is it feels like it is a torus but if you go in the settings and if you change the radius you can change its span if you change the small radius you can change its cross section if you change the uv segment it is going to smoothen out along the curve and v segment is going to change the segment across the cross section this is where it is different from torus ring manipulator if you change this it is going to shape it a little bit differently if you want you can make it a square shape or if you want you can make it a diamond shape curvy diamond this is where it is a little bit different and along with all along with that let me increase the v segments so that i can show you the next option this cross manipulator changes its cross section it curves it off or bulges it off and at one point it becomes exactly sharp this is what you can do with the help of super toyed along with that they gave this exterior and interior option this use interior and exterior radii if you take this off what it does is now if i change the big radius it is going to change the span but the thickness is the same but if i tick this and then change the big radius it is going to increase and de decrease its span from outer side and from inner side if i change the small radius it is going to change the cross section this is how these things works if you tick this off along with that they have given the option to align it according to the world or according to the view wherever we are seeing it from or according to the 3d cursor for those who don't know who what is 3d cursor this red and white dotted circle is called 3d cursor along with that you can change the location in x axis along with that in y axis in z axis as well and if you want you can change the rotation in x axis y axis z axis as well with that being said and done this is it for this guys if you like this video hit the like button hit the subscribe button and if you want to support me wholeheartedly you can go on the patreon page links will be given in the description or if you want to financially support me personally you can go on google pay phone pay paytm phone number will be given in the description as well and leave a comment if you want to make me feel better and with that being said and done try to see it learn it understand it i will see you in the next video and before leaving we will see one more object go to add go to mesh and then go to torus object and torus not before taking that let me delete this object go to add go to torus object and torus not what this is like it is like a knot an endless loop of knot just like our life mingled up and complicated resolution increases its quality how smooth it will be no not type are there are three types of not this is one type this is one type of not this is second type of not a little bit more complicated just when you get in relationship and things get even more complicated when you get a family <laughs> so this is what torus does you want if you want you can align it according to the world according to the view or according to the cursor you can change its location in x axis y axis z axis and rotation in x axis y axis along z axis as well that's it for this guys try to see it 
learn it understand it i will see you in the next video